So Turpin notches another victory on his way towards challenging for world honours. There were scenes of considerable activity on the banks of the Thames before the head of the River Silver Jubilee race, and no wonder some 200 crews had entered for the event. That could be massage, or is it nerves? Thames watermen wearing Doggett's coat and badge were in evidence, and one of them helped Princess Elizabeth into a launch. Her Royal Highness was there to start the race. It's a time race, of course, rode over the vasty boat race course in reverse, Mortlake to Putney. The event naturally fails to supply the thrill of the Oxford versus Cambridge Classic, soon to be contested again, but the spectacle of so many eights on the tideway at one time is undoubtedly impressive. The first five crews all finished in under 19 minutes, victory going to Jesus College, Cambridge, with Thames Rowing Club second. Two days later, Princess Elizabeth was at London Airport on her way to join the Duke of Edinburgh at Malta. It was, of course, raining in Britain, but weather elsewhere along the route was reported to be good. <laughs> 